Hey guys, it's Blair, the love guru from loveguru.net and aliennetwork.com. And one of my missions is to guide, help, heal, teach, and lead indigos in preparing for and doing their mission. And one of the main things, if not the only thing, <laughs> is the main thing, it's the core thing that I teach is that in order for you to step into your role as the leader of the new earth, you have to first heal yourself. You might say, well, heal yourself of what? And I'll say emotional, mental, and childhood wounds. So that's all the teachings that I share on how to do that, and I guide you through that with my books and my products and my programs and private sessions. And I bring that up to you today as far as, um, as it relates to QAnon, and you may have noticed that Q has been down for several days, and now today they have had a sign up that says, hey patriots, we're getting upgraded. And if, you know, come support us, and they have a link to a Patreon account. This is both funny and horrifying, and it proves my point as well, because one of Q's tactics is to prey on this whole programming of patriots. So I want you to understand that, because a lot of people in this truther movement are considered themselves patriots. Now there's nothing really wrong with like loving your country, but you have to understand that this is a form of brainwashing. This is a brainwashing that has been done to you. It's a form of programming that's been done to you. Again, just a reminder, I help deprogram people. I help deprogram you. And why do you want to do this? Well, because if you have these programs running, you are easily and totally able to be manipulated by people, things, the government, sources, whatever. And there are a lot of people out there who are these patriots who are in, who are awake and aware of the corruption going on in the world. You also have spiritual people who are supposedly awake and aware of what's going on in the world, but yet all of these people have fallen prey to this Q sensation. And again, this has to do with people not being healed, people not having done their healing work, their inner work. So sometimes I feel like people are like, I, I feel like spirit says to me like, well, Blair, connect the dots for people because I don't think they're really understanding why they have to heal themselves because they're like, I know about the corruption because this is stuff that makes you weak. So if you have been on the spiritual path, I'm gonna invite you to go deeper because so many people that I meet on the spiritual path, they say they've, they've done a lot of work. They've been on the spiritual path for a while. And then they come around me and I can feel the baggage that they have because that's what I help people with. I help people clear that mental, emotional baggage. So it makes me wonder what kind of work are people doing? And this is the thing that a lot of people are afraid of looking at their own darkness. So clearly they're going to be afraid of looking at the darkness that's going on in the world. And you fall into this program of that Q's going to save us, that this alliance is going to save us, that Trump is going to save us. And that is wrong, wrong, wrong. No empowered person, no person that has done their healing work. And I know that there's a lot of spiritual teachers out there that are saying, we're going to be fine. And they're tow uh, tooting, what's the word? Tooting QAnon and Trump being good. You're being misled. You're being misled. These are teachers of the old earth. And they are people who have not gone deep enough with their healing work. And I know it's like, well, Blair, only you have done your healing work? Well, I'm still on that path. Uh, and there are others of us out there also. But the only way that you're able to see clearly as far as what's going on in the world is when you deprogram yourself. And the way that you deprogram yourself is by healing your mental, emotional, and childhood wounds. 
So now with back to this QAnon, well, their upgrade, first off, they're going to be getting a bunch of morons paying them on the Patreon. So guess what? Not only are they draining the swamp, which is you, of your money, <laughs> they're going to be taking your money. They're also tracking you that way. That is horrifying. Funny on how people fall for that and horrifying because now you are a targeted inter individual. And why? Because you believe in this program of being a fantastic patriot. And I love my country. And I love my Trump. And I love this alliance. And we're going to be saved. All these celebrity arrests. Why are you paying attention to this stupid shit that is such low-level garbage? It's a distraction. It's all a distraction. So that's number one. For all the people who are going to sign up for this Patreon, they're tracking you then. You're going to be a targeted individual. Number two, when they upgrade their site, I'm sure they're going to have extra tracking of who's visiting their site. So if you're smart, you need to look into disguising your IP address if you're going to go there and start reading their updates. And if you want to share some links on how to do that below, I welcome that because I think I know how to do that, but I'm not 100% sure. And I could use your support <laughs> on how to do that. Lastly, what I'll say is that Indigos, we are Indigo warriors and those with Indigo warrior energy are um, basically the word Indigo means warrior or the way that I use it is it's your warrior. Us Indigos are activists. Part of our mission is to go into this darkness and to bring our light, to look at the truth of what's happening in the world and to clear out that corruption, to clear down the corrupt structures and then rise as a leader of the new earth. All right, it's a two-step process. When you're going into that darkness, well, since indigos spend a lot of time in the darkness, because that's the way we learn and that's the way we see what the problems are and that's how we clear the corruption, we become very susceptible to picking up darkness. So I made an audio download. You can find it on thealiennetwork.com. It's under Indigo Warriors Toolkit. And I highly suggest that you download that and you learn on how to clean, properly clean and clear your energy every time you go into this darkness. And it's much more than whatever you might be thinking. We'll just put it like that, okay? And it's the process that I have learned um, through my experience because my first several years of learning all about this new world order, I went into a lot of dark places and that started affecting my life and really junking my life. And I know there are people out there that have fears about that. And, but if you know how to successfully travel between the different timelines, again, if you're an indigo warrior, most likely you're a time traveler. I'm a time traveler. So when you learn how to successfully jump between the timelines and clear your energy so that you can pop, do that properly, well, then you're not at the effect of the dark energy. But, you know, there's this video out about Isaac Caffey. You might have heard about him because if you're a Q follower, well, Q people like talking about him because he's a Hollywood celebrity, you know, whatever level he was at. But he was an indigo. And I know because I feel the indigo's energy. I recognize them because I'm a teacher of indigos. So he went into the darkness and then that darkness overcame him. And again, that happens to a lot of indigos. So don't let it happen to you. Learn how to properly protect yourself so that you thrive and rise. And again, that detail, those details, you can download that audio on the AlienNetwork.com, Indigo Warriors Toolkit. And while you're there, make sure you sign up for the newsletter so we can keep in touch because this YouTube is a temporary situation. All right, bye-bye.